great in any area that you have skin laxities. This is plastic surgeon Dr. Katherine Grawi. She likes to film her surgeries and post them on TikTok, sometimes even live streaming procedures. Tonight, she's had her license to practice revoked. Don't just me and my man's a whole lot of chops on your ass. Best known as Dr. Roxy to her over 800,000 social media followers, she would even do dance numbers in her operating room. This is perfect. 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 In a hearing in front of the Ohio State Medical Board, Grawi said she posted the videos to teach people about plastic surgery. And sometimes I did silly or fun videos. Simply to make people smile in this world, which is often negative and difficult to navigate. Referencing one liposuction surgery she live streamed, the board wrote, your attention to the camera meant at those moments you were not looking at the patient and called her practice a danger of immediate and serious harm to the public. Three of her patients sought emergency medical attention after their surgeries, reporting skin tears, infections, and a perforated bowel, according to medical board records. She has single-handedly forever changed the lives of at least Three people. Grawi and her lawyer have not responded to NBC News's request for comment. The decision comes after five years of warnings from the state medical board. The lack of professionalism and poor judgment in delegating responsibilities to others appears to have significantly contributed to her calling below the standards of care. The board temporarily suspended her license last year following patient complaints that they were injured after surgery. Mary Jenkins successfully sued Grawe in 2019 after the tissue of her breast reconstruction died, telling our Columbus affiliate WCMH. It'll never go away because every time we look down and we see a scar, we're going to remember. Those scars having a lasting impact. There's now also a Facebook group with more than 2,000 members, many of them alleging that they were also harmed by Dr. Grawe. In addition to losing her license, the plastic surgeon was ordered to pay a fine of $4,500, and there still is the possibility that she could appeal the board's decision. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.